Good morning. Happy Tuesday. It is April 28th, 2020, and it is day 151 of school. We're going to lay out your day today. You're going to start with doing your calendar tally and weather chart. For PE, Miss Jill has recorded a video showing you how to make a ghost ball at your house with some materials that mom or dad may have. Um, so you can feel free to make a ghost ball today so that you have that to play with. I will put the video down below of this video so that you can watch Miss Jill. You're going to do an activity from your April choice board with your L-Y and F-U-L ending words, and then do one page in your grammar book. Um, you're, today you're going to log into Epic and listen or read books about sea otters. I have put a ton of books into everybody's mailbox on sea otters, and you can make your choice whether you want to do one listen to, one read, two listen tos, two reads. You make your choice. I'm going to see the girls at 11 a.m., today so the link is in the message here um, so just click it at 11 o'clock and make sure that you have your journal you're going to read one journal piece to us it can be any piece from the beginning of the year to all the way till now you get to choose whichever one you want to read and share with our group so 11 o'clock just the girls um, for writing this week we're going to write and send a letter to miss jean She's been missing you guys so much, and I thought it would be a nice surprise if she received letters in her mailbox, so I'm not telling her. Um, so today, I just want you to brainstorm some things that you could say to Miss Jean. You can do this on the back of a piece of paper. You can do this in your journal. These are just the, like the ideas that I like to list that you tell me in our classroom on the whiteboard. So before we start writing, we just kind of generate ideas and tell her things about you. You could ask her a question, anything like that. So just generate a bunch of ideas and then tomorrow you'll use that for your sloppy copy. You're gonna to go to Epic and listen to a book about shape attributes. We talked about this in yesterday's video. These are ways to describe shapes. So yesterday we talked about a triangle having straight lines, not curvy lines like a circle. And a triangle has three sides and it also has three angles or three corners. Um, so you're going to go on and listen to a book that I put in your Epic mailbox and it's called What is an Attribute? And then you're going to go on to Seesaw and do shape attribute number two. Yesterday you did number one, today you'll do number two. And then you can conduct your science experiment. Tomorrow you'll tell me what happened in your science experiment, but the only thing I need you to do today is if you haven't already. Some of you have started your science experiment and that's totally fine because maybe you needed more time or maybe it just worked out better with your week. That's fine. Today, I just want you to conduct your science experiment and make sure that you clean up afterwards. So we, we don't leave a huge mess whenever we do a science experiment. You have to kind of clean up afterwards. Um, and then tomorrow, we'll pull back out that paper that you worked on on Monday where you did your I wonder and I think parts. Tomorrow, we'll do the I know parts. So you can tell me what actually happened in your science experiment. So have fun with that and happy Tuesday. And I really look forward to seeing the girls on our video today. So I'll see you at 11 o'clock. Have a great day.